Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Mandy and I'm the Kitchen Wife. So if you're new to my channel, I am the Kitchen Wife. I have a food blog at thekitchenwife.net where I provide lots of delicious, healthy, affordable recipes with step-by-step -step pictures that show you how to make these things from start to finish. But I also have this YouTube channel because a big part of who I am as a person is seasonal living. And you'll notice if you look at my videos, um, I did a lot of stuff around Christmas time. Um, I do some like seasonal makeup tutorials and things like that. So yeah, I'm really into seasonal living, which is kind of what I formed this whole channel for. Just to kind of have a more visual look at that side of who I am as an influencer. Anyways, today I went to lunch with a friend of mine and we went to a place called Penn Station Subs, which is right next door to Pier 1 in my town. And I popped into Pier 1, which was probably my first mistake, because Pier 1 just, if you're a seasonal living junkie like I am, Pier 1 just plucks the seasonal living heartstrings of your heart. Um, I walked in and of course, it's just the mecca of home decor. And I walked back in the back of the store and there it was all of the patriotic home decor on sale for 20% off. So I immediately checked my phone and I had a coupon for 10% off my complete purchase. So that was, in essence, 30% off anything I bought. So I went in. I went in. And I know you guys love a good shopping haul, so I thought, why not just come home and film everything that I bought? So today is gonna be Pier 1 and a little bit of Dollar Tree. And yeah, I went crazy at Pier 1. But to start things off, we'll start with Dollar Tree. This might be a little chatty, so I hope you guys don't mind that. But every year my husband and I throw a huge 4th of July barbecue. We live right by our city park. And so you can see the city fireworks from my backyard. We set off a bunch of backyards. We have slip and slides and outdoor movies and guitars and fire pits. And it's just a really cool time. So I went to Dollar Tree and uh, kind of got a few decorations. First thing I got is these really, really awesome um, plastic American flag bunting to kind of go around my patio. These things are huge, like they're much bigger than my head. But yeah, so I got some of those to kind of hang around the back or hang around my back patio. And then um, I also got this really cute patriotic tassel garland. I thought this would be cute to like decorate outside or maybe even inside, we'll see. But I just really thought this was cute how it had like the patriotic stars and the little pom poms. And yeah, I thought this would be cute to decorate with and it was only a dollar, so why not, right? Then I got this really, really cute USA wind sock which will be awesome for by my back door or on my front porch, wherever I should choose to put it. Oh, and apparently I got two of those little tassel garlands. Oh, I think I was gonna put these on my food tables. That's what I was gonna do with them. That's why I got two of them. I also got this really, really cute home of the free. This is like a little wood, little home decor thing. I thought this would be pretty to hang by my back door. I kind of have a lot going on by my back door. I have flowers and that kind of thing. And this is just the perfect size um, hanger to just to add a bit of color right by my back door. So I got that. And then I picked up, let's see here. Oh, I picked up this really cute 4th of July cupcake set. I like to make cupcakes and put on my cupcake tier. And so these just have little Americana prints on them and these cute little American flag things to stick in the top. And then I got some really cute 4th of July paper straws, 24 paper straws for a dollar. I like to use these to decorate my house with just for like a little pop of color. And what else did I get in here? Oh, and then I got this really cute just summer dish towel drying mat. It was only a dollar. I thought it was really cute. It's not necessarily 4th of July related. I have one that I bought last year. But yeah, I thought this was pretty cute just for the summertime. So yeah, that was kind of my Dollar Tree haul. And now we can kind of get on with the big guns. The first thing I got was this really, really cute. I The rose lit slipped off the post. It's in the bag. But it's this really cute 
wood rosette Americana wreath for my front door. I just think this is absolutely stunning. Um, it was originally $49.95 and then I had 30% off of that. Yes, this is a little bit pricey. I will give that to you. But again, you know, I'm just to the point in my life, and I said this at Christmas time, where I want to buy nice things that are going to last me a while, not just something to fill a space. And so I saw this and I fell in love with it. And yeah, sorry, I'm trying to make sure I don't put anything on top of my dogs. You guys know I always have my dogs in the background. But yeah, I'm just trying to buy nice things um, that are going to last me for a while. Next up, let's see what's in this bag. Oh. Next up, I got these really, really cute indoor-outdoor placemats for my dining room table. I like them because they are kind of like a plasticky material. I got four of them. They're kind of like a plasticky material, so I can I can wash these really nicely and clean them up. But yeah, I thought those would be really cute on my dining room table. And then I got for my couch in my living room. This is really nice. Oh, those placemats were $3.95 a piece, and then I had 30% off. And then I got this really pretty American flag pillow for my couch. You guys know from Christmas how I like my pillows. And this was $24.95, and then I had 30% off of that. Oh, I really love this. I kind of wish I would have gotten two of these. Okay, this was the next thing that I got. This really pretty wood rosette, like flower arrangement, wood flower arrangement. I'm gonna use this as part of my tablescape, but it matches the wreath that I have in the front of my house, and I just think this is really, really pretty. I kind of wish I would have gotten two of these to use my mantle now, but yeah, I just absolutely love this. I think it's so darling. Then I got this bag of just red, white, and blue stars to use as filler. I have a lot of like mason jars and stuff around my house that I switch things out with seasonally. So I thought these would be really pretty to um, put in those jars. Oh, before I forget, the flower decor thing was $24.95 with 30% off. And then this was $9.95 with 30% off. Then I got this really, really darling star garland. Um, I thought this would be really pretty to put on my mantle. Um, I'm really new at decorating the living room part of my house, so this year I just kind of have this garland and a pillow I'm gonna put in there, but it's like a really dense felt material. It's, it's a lot more, um, it's a lot nicer than just felt. It's definitely more durable than just felt, but it's this really pretty like star garland that I got with these red, white, and blue stars. This was $9.95 with 30% off. And then I got this really pretty um, pendant banner. So it has like red and white little flags. And then if you can see, the band at the top is the blue with the stars. And I think this is so darling. Um, I'm either going to hang this on my mantle and then the star garland in my dining room or this in my dining room and the star garland in, on my mantle. I'm not really sure which one is which, but I liked them both and I thought I can use them both, so I got them both. And then the last thing I got, and I'm really, really excited about this. I'm good. It's wrapped up. Let me unwrap it and I'll come back to you. Okay, the last thing I got today was this gorgeous red lantern. I'm gonna use this in the center of my table. And yeah, this was a little bit pricey. This was $34.95 with 30% off. But like I said, um, you know, I got a couple really nice pieces because I'm just buying stuff that's gonna last me a while now. And uh, so yeah, that is my patriotic home decor haul. Coming at you soon will be my 4th of July home house tour. So I hope you're looking forward to that. If you are new to my channel and you kind of like what you've seen here, please be sure to subscribe down below and click that little bell beside the subscribe button so that you know every time I upload and give this video a thumbs up and leave me some comments down below. I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.